I got a I got a question for everybody. You know, Father's Day's coming up. And uh Sunday, right? That's this Sunday. Yes, it's coming mm, up this Sunday. It's, it's Father's Day. And I want to know who is the best movie or TV dad? Text the Riot Hotline with uh your thoughts. Oh, we gotta get the, the Riot Hotline going. The Riot Hotline. 8772 Radio U. Light it up with who you think is the, the best TV or movie dad. We could rank real dads, but everybody most people probably would just have theirs number one. You think they'd pick their own? Or be real sad to pick biased. somebody else that's not your dad. It would be that would be real sad either way. So let's just do TV dads, TV and movie dads instead. Anybody uh, jump to mind off the top for you? Hmm. Well, we have to. The first one that came to mind for me, I'm thinking Liam Neeson. I mean, Liam what Neeson. kind of what kind of a father lets their daughter get taken and doesn't take her back? Yeah. And he doesn't do it just once. He does it three times. And taking one, <laughs> yeah. taking two, taking three. Now that's a dad. Yeah. I mean, he he has a certain set of skills. Uh-huh. To where he's gonna he's gonna find him no matter what. Yeah. And cause some damage along the way. Yeah, I, I uh I wouldn't mind Liam Neeson being my dad. I mean, you'd feel awful safe, right? I mean, yeah. pretty much anything that happens to you. I don't know. His you, daughter did get taken a couple I times. I guess she did get taken three times. Is he a good or a bad dad? Which then? also is he a bad dad? I don't know. No, because he saves her. He saves Many her. Many other like, dads wouldn't wouldn't do that. I mean, they wouldn't be able to save her, but also they might not they might not get taken three times. Yeah, but she was out on her own. Like she was grown. Um, which time so it's her it's of your daughter being it's not taken. It's his fault she was taken. It's like fool me once, shame on shame on you, fool me twice, shame on me. Fool me three times. I yeah. mean that's where we at now. Yeah, right. <laughs> Whatever it also calls to mind um uh, Kiefer Sutherland, Jack Bauer. In 24. Oh, yeah. He also has a daughter that seems to repeatedly get kidnapped. So uh, I wouldn't, I actually wouldn't put him near the top of the list. How about, uh, here's one that I like, way different. Bob from Bob's Burgers. Bob from Bob's Burgers. I've he's never seen gr- Bob's Burgers. He's a great Burgers. dad. He's a great Is dad. He's a good dad. Much more competent than some other cartoon dads uh, like Homer Simpson, Peter Griffin. Mm. I think Bob Belcher is uh, is a dad that. That I wouldn't mind having. That you would get behind? Yeah, I think, I think I'd like to be in his family. How about Marlon? Marlon? Oh, from, from Nemo. Finding, finding Nemo. Nemo. He goes across the whole ocean to find his kid. Yet again, I feel like a lot of these movies, they're losing their child to get him back. But, I mean, he went across the whole ocean to find Nemo. That, that is true. He's, he's like... Um, He's, he's like, like Liam Neeson. He's like Liam Neeson. Just like a wimpier version. Except that it's kind of his fault that his son got taken, though. Yeah, the first it's time. It's not Liam Neeson's fault that his daughter got taken. That's and taken. fair. Uh, but, yeah, Marlon, uh, he did, again, what a lot of dads wouldn't be able to do, and that is track his son down oh, yeah. and save him. So, good on him. He's a good dad. Any other ones you can think of that are some, mm, some top ones? I'd like to see some suggestions texted in at 8772-RADIO-U. If you've a got good a good idea. movie or TV dad, let us know. And uh, we'll, we'll see what you have to say. See if we get any good suggestions coming up. Add a little riot to your Instagram feed. Follow at Radio U Official. The Riot. Radio U. Talking with Father's Day coming up on Sunday. We're talking the best TV and movie dads. And getting lots of texts, lots of suggestions on, uh, on who they are. Let's see. I've got... Uh, Ben here. You ever watched? Uh, you ever watched the children's show, show Bluey? Never seen it. We've talked about it before. Uh huh. But I've never seen it. Well, Ben has. He says the dad from Bluey. His name is Bandit. Good old Bandit. And what a great name. It's a good name. I wish my dad's name was Bandit. Bandit. That'd be a wild name for a dad. Yeah. So that's Ben's suggestion for best uh, TV dad. Oh, this is a sad one. Danny says Tony Stark. Was he a good, I guess he was a good dad. He was a good dad. He was a good dad. He was a pretty good leader I mean, for, for Spider-Man the, to follow. He saved the world. He did save the world. Multiple times over. So, uh, yeah, he was, he was kind of like the Earth's dad in a way. The he universe's was. dad. Um, what about, oh, here's a great one from Sam. Mr. Incredible. From the Incredibles. Of course. I love it. That's a great one. That's a great, I love the Incredibles. That's a good answer. That's a fantastic suggestion. Um, Amanda. Going full 90s here, saying Uncle Phil from Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. See, I had that one listed, too. That I have a list of four. Uh-huh. Now I have a list of three. That's a fantastic one. Also, Danny Tanner, as I said, full 90s mm-hmm. from Full House. And that uh, jogged my memory. What about uh, sticking in that, in that kind of time frame? Carl Winslow from Family Matters. 
Mm, that's a good one too. Yeah, yeah. I know. All those old shows. Uh huh. They always had a great dad. Oh, they always pretty much do. always. Uh, what else did you have? I had old Matthew McConaughey from in Interstellar. Oh, that's a good that's, one. Is that a pretty good Murph? That's a Can pretty you hear good me, Murph? That's a good dad. That is right? a good dad. That's a Any dad, good dad that's just trying to to save their kids. Get back to his daughter. Uh huh. That's uh-huh. a good dad. I had that one. I also had, the, and then Jaden just texted this one until uh, Phil from Modern Family, Phil okay. Dunphy. If you've seen Modern Family, he's just hilarious. He's a good dad. Dang. Um, so that's a good one. Time out. Jessica just stole my next one. I was going to go with Clark Griswold from uh, the Vacation movies. He just wants everybody to have a good Christmas. Like, what yeah. do you want from him? Uh huh. He's a great, he, what a great dad. It's a great dad. Uh-huh. Uh huh. And then the final one that I had, how about Mufasa? Yeah, from the Lion he's King. a pretty good dad. He's a good dad to Simba, right? He had to be. He sacrificed himself for Simba, yet again, sacrificing himself for their child, good father. Yeah, I'm with you on that. What about uh, what about all the dads in uh, Daddy's Home and Daddy's Home 2? Oh, those are good movies. Those are good, yeah, those are, that's, that's a movie you got to put on for Father's Day this weekend. Oh, Daddy's Home? Daddy's that's Home. A great, I think that's one with Will Ferrell, right? Bill, Will Ferrell Mark and Mark Wahlberg. Wahlberg. Yeah, those are good movies. And the second one uh, that's has That's a good their Father's dads, Day movie, yeah. John Lithgow and uh, Mel Gibson. Yep, I've seen it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah good man. I'm excited good for one. Father's Day now. Yeah, what are you going to do for Father's Day? Fun uh, stuff? I can't reveal what if my dad's oh, listening. Oh, it's a surprise, surprise. Yeah, I didn't some know you of that's like got to that. stay, some of it's got to stay under wraps. I didn't know so. you had a surprise down like that. No, yeah. Me that, watching some Father's Day movies. You know what? Go watch Taken. Watch Taken yes, on Sunday. that's right. If you like that video, there's a ton more. Go check out our past videos and subscribe so you don't miss what we do next.